How's it going guys? So I picked up this Barnum, Bajarnum, however you want to say it. These little coat hangers that they have at Ikea or you could buy this on Amazon. Put a link in the description for that. And I don't really need this as a coat hanger, but what I really do like this for is as something to screw onto the side of your desk for your headphones. And so I thought this was really cool. So, you know, unfortunately you have to get a pack of three. So if you have multiple things you can hang, that's great. If not, then you're going to have some left over. Maybe you can give them to someone you like. So they don't come with screws. So I found some screws that I'm hoping are gonna work for this. And so it feels really sturdy, a little hard to pull here. But so we would screw it onto the wall like this and then we'll just pull this part down. And then we could just pull this part back to the top like that. And just to try to mimic the screws that are on the picture, I found these. They're kind of small, which you don't want it to be too big, but it's flat on this side like that. That way you could just put it right through and there's actually a piece of tape there. So we'll just pop through that. And then I think that'll work. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this up and then just show you guys how it looks. All right, so I just screwed this onto the side of my desk. I only used one screw uh, because I'll just finish this project later, but as you can see, it just attaches right there. I'll move this camera up a little bit, just like that. And then we can just pull it back down, set our headphones right there. And it's really nice. I'm not gonna have to put my headphones on the ground or on the printer anymore. I could just always hang them right here. They're off to the way, off to the side here. And it works really good. It locks right there at the top. So if you don't want it sticking out, just push it up in there and it just snaps in. And this was the screw I was going to try to use, but it ended up being a little too small. So ended up getting a bigger screw. Uh, and so you want something that's probably at least a half an inch uh, for it to hold there pretty good. So thanks guys for watching. And I'll see you on the next video.